Hi everybody, uh, welcome back to Beauty Disclosure. If you don't know, my name is Jenna and you're very welcome here. This is a YouTube channel dedicated to kind of budget friendly skincare, um, hair care, nails, all that type of thing. Um, so this week I realised that I haven't actually done a video on hyaluronic acid. Um, and I got the Inculus Hyaluronic Acid Serum, but you know what? I haven't actually done a video to explain what hyaluronic acid is, what it does. And so I thought I'd just do a quick video and uh, yeah, show you guys. So let's get into it. So we are talking hyaluronic acid. Um, I haven't tried the Inculus one before, but I've tried other products with hyaluronic acid in them. You will see hyaluronic acid is one of those ingredients which is almost in everything nowadays. Um, I think it must be quite an easy ingredient to add to other products. So yeah, uh, hyaluronic acid for anybody who doesn't know is this fantastic ingredient. It's actually a natural ingredient which is in your skin. It's in, um, it's also in like your eyes and other areas. Um, basically what it does um, is it has the ability to retain water and moisture and lubricate areas like your skin, your eyes, things like that. Um, it's a fantastic ingredient. For your skin, it's really good. Um, if you get dehydrated skin, Hyaluronic acid is going to be your friend. Um, so what it does is it basically takes moisture from the atmosphere and brings it into your skin and kind of plumps your skin up and just brings moisture back into your skin. So if you do get dehydrated skin or dry skin, hyaluronic acid is going to be your friend. This one by the Inky List, um, actually has Matrixel 3000 in it as well, which is a bit of a funny one. Um, I had to look it up because I wasn't 100% sure what Matrixel 3000 is, but basically it's a peptide. Um, it's like two peptides in one. And what it does is it helps to get into your skin as well, renew and re rejuvenate your skin, if I can get that word right. And it actually helps your skin um, look younger and it's like cell renewal basically is what it's doing so that's a great ingredient to have so if you ever see matrixel 3000 you will know that that's really good it's, it helps your skin to renew um and grow keep your skin younger and things like that so i really like um hyaluronic acid it is good for my skin because i've got normal to touch dry at times depending on the time of year and just kind of what's going on at the time but i really like the hyaluronic acid this one here i'll put a little video up of me putting it on my skin um it is very watery so you can hear that it's a very wet consistency this one and um, which i wasn't quite expecting um and it's one of these caps that you kind of open and close and um, which is fine um however it's um i don't know if you can see that there it does mean like a little goes a long way. So you, you just need like maybe four or five drops um, and it sinks into your skin like almost immediately. It's really nice. I The only thing I would say, this packaging, the easiest way, I like I don't squeeze it out because if you squeeze it out, it's going to be too much every time. So I shake it and then put it onto the palm of my hand to get the drops to come out and then I can rub it and pat it into my skin. The best time to put hyaluronic acid on is after you've washed your face. Like it should be the first thing to go on after you've washed your, washed your face. Do not dry completely your skin. It does better. It actually says it on the packaging as well. Um, Inky List is very good about like explaining how their products work, how they work better, things like that. It works better with damp skin so just take off like any excess wetness 
and basically just dab it on when it's still wet and it will take that moisture and it will suck it into your skin keep your skin um full of moisture and it also makes your skin a bit plumper because it's got extra moisture in there which is not a bad thing because you don't want your skin to look like it's thin you know you kind of want that plumpness in your skin um so use that's why hyaluronic acid's used a lot of in um products nowadays because it's used to like plump up the skin and make the skin look um fuller and thicker and younger and um, but it is only a temporary measure um that's why you kind of have to use it every day but yeah i really like this it's really nice i feel like it goes into your skin straight away it's i was like i said before it's a very wet consistency but it's actually really really nice um and yeah hyaluronic acid is a handy little ingredient to have um you the one thing i will say is you always have to put a moisturizer on top of hyaluronic acid um hyaluronic acid is made to like suck moisture right like i said however if you don't seal it in with a moisturizer it can then suck the moisture out of your skin so always 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 Put a moisturizer on after you've put your serums on after you've used hyaluronic acid always do that otherwise yeah it's um not so good but yeah um use it in the bathroom after you've just washed your face is the perfect perfect time to use it so yeah that is the inky lists hyaluronic acid and um, let me know if you've tried it or if you found a different one that you like I'm always, always up for learning different brands and things like that. And if there's any particular brands you want me to start reviewing, again, comment down below. Please let me know. Um, yeah, uh, it's all good. Hyaluronic acid is just one of those lovely little gems of an ingredient. And Inky List, again, is a really good brand. I feel like they're really good at... Um, having good quality ingredients and just focusing specifically on specific ingredients and not just like throwing everything at it and uh, so yeah i do like the inky list but yeah like i say any anything you want me to try or any other um hyaluronic acid serums that you guys use and you love let me know um and yes so thank you guys for watching please like and subscribe to the channel it's helping us we're still quite young so i think we've been on here for a year now um and we're growing it takes a little while to grow but i'm certain that if you guys are loving it i'm gonna keep doing it so so yeah um so let's uh keep the channel going so give us a like and a thumbs up and i will see you soon bye